Yo, what's going on, everybody? Go by the name of Dom Cruz, reviewing Rebels. Welcome to the revisit of Deliver Us from Eva. It's your boy Keith, aka Baron Keysmo. All right, let's get into it. Uh, it came out February 7, 2003. Did you go to the movie theater and see it? No. No, you didn't. You caught it again. At, what did you go see in 03 in the movie theaters then? I can't. Yeah, well, you asked me to remember yeah, 2003 remember. movie theaters. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What came? What else came out that year? Remember we did Daredevil. You went to theater. Oh, okay, Daredevil. I saw in the uh, theater. How to Lose a Guy in Ten Days. We did that. I did not see that yeah, in theater. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I wish it would have. It was a great movie though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Even back me looking at it 20 years ago was a good movie. Yeah. Um, so right now you can find this movie on Peacock, uh, Amazon Prime. Uh, but the rest of them got paid. The average rent is 3.99. Redbox is still having it crazy. All right. That's a Redbox? <laughs> Director wow. is Gary Hardick. I don't know what else he did. Um, the top five is starring Elo Cool J, Gravia Union, Dwayne Martin, Essence Atkins again. This is the second movie we did with her. Making Good. <laughs> Wait a minute. What <laughs> other movie did we do? We did with Haunted her? House. She yes, she it. was. Yeah, yeah. Okay. And Mel Jackson. Remember Mel Jackson? Mel Jackson. The light skin dude from the light, yeah. yeah. Yep. Um, so I don't know the budget, but box office, what do you think it is? I'm not, uh, not much. 30 mil. 30 mil. Wow. You're giving it a lot of grace on that one. Hold on. I was trying to be generous because I really feel like it might yeah, be like are, 15. Uh, you're close on that one. $17.6 million in the box office. Damn, this for sure took a loss. You got yeah, LL yeah, and Gabriel yeah, Union in yeah. it? Yeah. Yeah. I mean, they, they at least at that time, probably five million each. Yeah. But for the culture, it's in the culture, right? I think so. Yeah. You think it's. Top, I know my, my wife likes it a lot. Top 10 culture? No. Nah, hell no. Nah. <laughs> no, like top 10, I guess, rom com cultures. Top 10 black rom coms, yeah, basically. Yeah. No, because you got Love and Basketball. Love, love and Basketball. Love Jones. Uh, Best Man? Oh Is yeah, best man. Room? Yeah, best man. You best man best holiday. Man. Damn, yeah, best um, man holiday. What else we got? Booty call? I help? guess the booty call. Uh-huh. Woo, one of them. Woo. Yeah. Um, um Jason Lyrics. Jason's yeah, lyrics for sure, rom com. Yeah, so no, that's not um, looking good. What's love got to do with it? Oh, yeah, I like love I mean, got to do with it. Ooh, yeah. that's an 03 too. I can't wait till we get to that one. I mean, too. I know one's supposed yeah. to be funny, but yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that nigga Lawrence Fishburne <laughs> had me cracking up, so I don't know. Um, yeah. Wait and exhale. It had a lot of comedy in it. Oh, you said? Did you say love don't cost a thing, or did you say love? What did you say? What's love got to do with I it? Sworn, <laughs> what the did Tina he say? Turner movie. You don't know what he said. Uh, I thought you said love don't cost a thing. No, with, with oh, Nick Cannon in the oh, pool. Oh, yeah, movie. that's top to me. Yeah, yeah. You do some homo I saw thug. that in the theater. That, oh, <laughs> you did? I saw yeah. that on bootleg. Um, actually, Soul Plane's in 03, too. I can't wait till we get to that one. But um, Oh, man. Yeah, so I remember seeing this movie. I don't know where I... I, I remember seeing it at home. I think they may have rented it from Blockbuster. And I remember it was kind of like a... How to lose a guy in ten get, days? When I think about it, it right? was very how yeah. to lose a guy in ten days. Yeah, yeah. It, was it was LL. They both came out the same year. That's same year. definitely same year. One of those movies where yeah. they were like, "Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. let's yeah. copy that." Yeah, to do the black versions. Yeah, yeah. Who knows which one came out first? It's definitely um, uh, how to lose a guy in ten days. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Or right. So this was the black version of How yeah. to Lose a Guy in Ten Days. It was, was giving, good. Yeah, it was, he was, it was giving good. her hell. Yeah, he was, he was giving, giving her, her hell. hell. Or she was giving him hell, right? Or they was giving each other hell. I can't really remember. They paid him. Yes, to, they did. Yeah, she was giving him hell. Yes, yes, Because yes. they paid him to date her. Because the homegirl, or to, the, the people that was dating, the sisters and brothers. Yeah. Yeah, they uh, paid him to get them off the ass. Yeah. He kept a cop blocking. She kept cop blocking them. Yeah. Because was, she was the big sis. And that's what I think. This was the first movie where we thought Gabriella was a bitch. Yeah. Because yeah, this was I think one of the first roles. And they uh, and then what happened? They she wound up finding out about it. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. But then he really he really liked her. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And then you know that's how it went. Uh, so we're gonna get to reviews. Uh, reviews from three years ago is by probably somebody from Africa. I can't remember. <laughs> God damn. Can't pronounce the name. All right. He he or she says. The best movie ever, and it's still one of my ever right one. These reviews be crazy. One of my favorites, my most favorite actress, Eva. Why would you say Eva? It's obviously 
Gabriel Union. Wow. It's funny and enjoyable. It's great for movie night. That was one three years ago. I think this person might be from a place where yeah. they found a box of old DVDs yeah, and those yeah, are the only thing, movie yeah. in the country. Yeah. <laughs> like seven <laughs> yeah. movies. Right. And this is the greatest one ever. <laughs> uh, two years ago, says Michelle O. Oh, says, love it. Eva embodies what it means to be an independent woman. However, the sisters sometimes did act bit clingy and i did honestly forget two of them but love this rom-com definitely definitely recommend grab your union she was amazing she was really good in it. yeah mm-hmm. yeah yeah hello cool j too right oh yeah oh well, he what kills everyone he, he kills everyone wow i mean i'm not saying he's a <laughs> yeah yeah, yeah amazing actor but yeah, 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 any yeah, role yeah. he's in have you ever been like He's doing a terrible job. Yeah, nah, no, nah, not really. You're right. He does what they yeah. hire him to do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He gets to, he understands the assignment. Yeah. Um, there's what I was about to say, their chemistry. What do you think of their chemistry? I think they had good mm. chemistry. I think I could I could see them actually dating. I mm. believed it. Mm. Okay, I give them like a B. B? Yeah, yeah it was yeah. Like, what was off about it? I don't know. It just wasn't at the level. When I give a chemistry, I'd be like, I wouldn't mind like having that as a goal. Like mm. I could, that's what that, in my opinion, that's what see the chem that's where I come from with this chemistry. All right. Um then the last review we got was from a year ago, Catherine McQuillan. What a great movie. I love LL and Gabriel Union as an actor and their brilliance together. So glad I found it on Netflix. Didn't even know it existed. Damn. Didn't even know it existed. Didn't even know what and how Catherine, old is this person? I don't know. But she did it a year ago. The um, respect she got to have, the respect she had to have, or being bored in the house to look at this movie and do a review about it a year ago. <laughs> um, as I'm doing reviews from 20 years ago. But um, I was literally about to say, who sits there <laughs> yeah. and writes reviews yeah. about old ass movies? movies? Yeah. And then I thought, I was like, I had a whole podcast. Right, no, yeah, so right. Review old dead ass, ass movies. Dead ass, yep. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, you know how we do it here. Uh, sequel, remake, series, or just leave it as is? Mm. You know what? I can see him doing a series. You know, L-O, really? L-O, he got series yeah. under his belt. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He so does, yeah. he's the TV guy. Mm-hmm. Why not bring it back as a, as a well, little. Well, pitch the TV series because me, I'm just leaving it as is. I, I have no. You're going to see the, the life they have afterwards. After? Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. But what's the drama in it? Like, what? No drum. I wanted to be oh, I see, you know, like the a happy Upshaws. comedy kind of. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That could work, yeah. With a laugh. Similar track? to like um with a laugh track yeah, in the background. Okay. Yeah, that'd be fire. What is that show that used to come on um with Zarya? Um The Parenthood or something like oh, that. Oh, okay. Something like that. Okay. A yeah. comedy and, or okay. or the the show with uh Dwayne Martin and uh Lisa Ray. Oh, okay uh two can have no no it was uh, all of us all of us yeah okay yeah. okay something like that yeah, yeah. <clears throat> that would make sense did you know mel gibson was in this movie where the fuck was mel gibson i don't know in this it movie? just says it on the cast bro get yeah, out of here i swear it does i was like what the fuck <laughs> i don't remember seeing yeah. mel gibson that now i'm gonna have to go watch it yeah damn you can catch it on netflix right now um you know my favorite thing i like to do shit i think you do not know I'm, I'm probably not gonna know. Not none of them. That's my goal. All right. Number one. LL last film was when? His last film? Yeah. What was his last film? Was it uh, Mindhunters? No. His last film was you ate Grudge my bird. Match. Oh. <laughs> 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 Oh man. Uh okay. Gabriel Union did two movies in ninety nine. What was those films? Bring it on. Bring it on one of them? No. Damn, that wasn't ninety nine? These movies no. How do you do that shit from without pushing a button? <laughs> he fucking up over here. <laughs> Bruh, what are you doing well, with the robot not, voice? Doing this shit. Yeah, right, type shit. But okay. anyway, so it wasn't these two movies are very close together. Very close together. I don't remember. I get all these movies mixed up. Yeah, but it's it's one of the movies with Jet Li. No, no. So one movie is 
She's all that. She's all that. We're in the, the the same thing. They like pay the dude, or he wants to become popular. It's like the love don't cost a thing version. All right, and guess what? Ten things I hate about you. She was in Ten Things yeah. I Hate About You. Same movies. Those are wow. I like Ten Things I Hate About yeah, You. Yeah, yeah, I like. That's it Heath too. Ledger, right? Yep, Heath Ledger, and then yeah. uh, old girl. Uh, no, not even Tri- old girl. That old girl, but it's also the other guy that was Robin. In the Heath Ledger, he was yeah. in that. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Um, Joseph Gordon Levitt. Yeah, there you I go. Love, he's Gordon a great Levitt. actor, man. Uh, which one of the cast members you think graduated from NYU? I'll say the the top five cast again. That's important. L. O. Cool J, Gabriel Union, Dwayne Martin, Essence Atkins, and Megan Good. So, out of those five, who you think graduated from NYU? Essence Atkins. Essence Atkins. That is wrong. Damn. I thought you was gonna get this answer. It's Dwayne Martin because you know you play for the Knicks. Did you know that? Dwayne Martin ain't play he for the He did play for the Knicks. Are you confusing bro, him with John Starks? No, look him up. Because he likes getting... No, he hooping, bro. He really hoop. He really hooped? Yeah. That was really him out there yeah, in, really in above him. the rim? Yeah, that was really him. Yeah, that was really him, bro. Get out of yeah. here. He really <laughs> went to NYU, huh? Yeah. Okay. All right. One of the cast members met their former husband on Match.com. Who do you think it was? <sighs> Who's been married? Okay. Former. Well, I know it's not LL. Okay. Okay, we can eliminate, eliminate him. Choose for me, right? Um, making good to find be on Match. dot com, so okay. I'm gonna eliminate her. So you got I know more. it ain't Gabrielle Union. Okay, I'm I'm gonna go with Essence Atkins. Hey, Essence Atkins, you got it right, man. <laughs> Finally, I don't, what, I don't know what this button is, but yeah, all right, Essence Atkins. All right, uh, all right. One of the cast members played in two episodes of Jet Jackson. He used to love that show. Damn. One of the cast members. <laughs> the process of elimination. Yeah, there you go. I know, it was, right. I know it's not LL or okay. Gabrielle Union. Okay. I know it's not. It might be Dwayne Martin. It's Dwayne Martin. Uh, it is uh, Making Good. Making Good? I don't yeah, remember her on Jet Jackson. Yeah, nobody does because she played Damn. like two. Like, yeah, it wasn't nothing important, but yeah, man. Huh. Yeah, you did good. You got one out of five. One out man. of five. One out of five is not bad. Uh, thank you for joining me. Another episode of the revisit of shooting like Shaq at the free throw line. <laughs> right Deliver us from Eva, two thousand three. Uh, Simo on uh, the video. Thanks for that. Uh, thank out. you for being a contestant. <laughs> to the next Anytime. one, man. I go by Dom Cruz. I go by Keith. Yeah, hey, that's it. <laughs> that's man. it. All right, we out.